What is going on everybody? Thank y'all for tuning in to Vashon Life. Today, we're going to fix the Mercedes-Benz water pump in the 2001 SLK230 RO170. So it's the same deal for a couple of years up and a couple of years down, 1999. But this is what we're going to be replacing. This water pump right here. Uh, not that bad. Not that hard, but let's get into it because I'm going to do a little intricate details to make sure that y'all get it on there right. And uh, let's do it right now. Alright, so the main thing to tackle this water pump is uh you need a e10 but if not you can use a eight millimeter and an eight millimeter a fit on the tensioner and pull that thing to the left so that you can loosen the belt off and then right here you need tens 10 millimeter take all four of those off then you can get to the body of that thing now it's not that hard to you know use a clamp to take that off flathead for this one and a flathead for 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 this one right here flathead for this one right here so it's three hoses one two three and then you can see what's behind there and uh let's pull this thing going off let's check this water pump i mean let's change this water pump and let's see what we can get into all right belt is off of there now we can get to work so now that we got the belt off, and remember how to put this belt on, y'all, because I know a lot of folk, when they take these belts off, they are clueless as to how the belts go back on. So remember, when you take the belt off, remember how these belts go back on. All right? Do not get yourself caught up in a situation where you have no clue how to put these belts back on. Because that's a bad situation to be in. Terrible, terrible, terrible. All right, so we're gonna move this. We're gonna move this belt. The belt would allow me to move it. There we go. Yeah, and we ain't gotta move it off a whole lot. We can keep the belt. We can keep the belt going. We ain't gotta move it off a whole lot. All right. So now let's get to to taking this puppy off right here. Let's take that off. All right. So, when you're taking these off, what you got to do is get your two 10 millimeters, put one on one side, one on the other, and you just got to split them apart. Split them apart like this here. As y'all can see, y'all see how I got one on one side and one on the other? Just take that thing and break them. And it should break them just like that did. Should break them. All right, let me show y'all a trick to get these off. Now y'all know, once y'all y'all can use like I did, right? Y'all y'all can use 10 millimeters, hold one, and kind of like work them together to get them all off. But it's always gonna be one that's super tight. If y'all can't get that off, let me show y'all a trick on how to get it off. You get you one of these right here. Put it on there like that and hold it. And then you put this thing on there. And you pull it and that tin will pop it right off. So get you one of these and hold it tight. And it will come right off. So that's a little trick to get that thing off. So that you can get all of them off. Because one of them going to be tight if you use it the way I just used it. To get all of them off. One of them going to stay remain tight on there. See what we got. Let's see what we got. Hmm. All right, let's take that off. Okay, 
There you go. All right, got that puppy off. One off. That's the water pump right there. Let's see what's going on with it. There's a lot of water down there, so this might be the issue. But let's see what's going on with it. All right, my bad, y'all. Just had to make a quick text to my baby. So, these right here, you got to, uh oh, what is wrong with this thing? Oh my god, you know what? Oh, I gotta put a better one on there, y'all. Hold on a second. This one ain't gonna cut it. This one ain't gonna cut it. Gotta put a better one on there. Hold on. How y'all doing today, man? Y'all feeling good? It's hot out here in Florida, man. I'm talking about 98 degrees today. And it feel like every bit of them 98. Feel like every bit of that 98. I thought I had a short extension, but I guess not. Alright, y'all. So, I got the 8 millimeter right here. I don't know if you can see that, but it's an 8 millimeter, And we're going to use that. This is an E10. So if you got an E10, use it. Let me show y'all. Put up on it. This is an E10. So if you got an E10, use it. And you got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and 7 on there. So let's see what we got. There we go. There we go. Well, that was easy. But let's take these hoses off first. I just wanted to make sure the even one works fine. See if I can see if this perfect. Alright, we'll start with this bottom one here. Unhook that. Perfect. Perfect. So, we, we got that one unhooked. Maybe a little more time before I can get it. What's the name? Alright, so let's do the second one. Yeah, you should grab that like that. Grab that, pull that all the way back. Pull that all the way back. There you go. Get it. Go ahead and get that out the way. Go ahead and get that out the way. This one right here, last one. Y'all see? Even the clamps still got the. Mercedes Benz logo on it. Y'all see that? Even the clamp still got the Mercedes Benz logo on it. I don't know if you can see it, but that just means there's uh, it's a lot of a lot of Mercedes Benz parts still on it, still good. And uh, that's what you like to see, man. You like to see that that that, that the car is original as it can possibly be. That's what you like to see. Yeah. It ain't always easy to find an original vehicle, but if it's original, oh man, hold on, I done messed up. It was moving and grooving. Still. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. <clears throat> There we go. All right.
All right, y'all. We're going to take these hoses off. And let's do it right now. Oh, this thing here. All right, so we got one hose off. We got another hose off. Kind of, kind of smash those in there. And this third hose, let's get this baby off. We, if we can. There you go. All right, got all the hoses off, just leaking like crazy. All right, now we got to get to the hard part. Getting off these bolts. All right, y'all. We got to take the first boat out. All right, y'all. We got to take the first boat out. I got it right. I'm trying to keep this thing stationary. This is the first boat right there. It's at the bottom. You might have to do a little finagling to get it out, but let's see if we can get it out. There it go. It's going to come out a little gunky, but to bring that thing on out. All right, y'all. I'm taking this last boat out. Now, this last boat is directly under here. It's hard to get to. So, y'all y'all, y'all can feel it. Uh, it's going gonna, it's gonna to be kind of... Now, you may want to take this belt off. I only took one off. You may want to take this one off, but... I can get to it without it, but just in case this belt become a problem, you can take the belt off too. But you might want to put two hands in there and kind of try to feel your way to loosen it. I already loosen it. There you go, I got it. This is the boat that's the problem. Y'all can see that? Oh. This boat. Let me see. Can you, can you, can you. This is the boat. It's, it's small. Eight millimeter, but it's a hard, hard getting it out, and it's directly under everything. It's directly under everything. All right, now the other ones should be fairly easy to take off. So you make sure you have an eight and a ten ready. And pull that one out. Look at that. Terrible looking. There. The long one came out there. Alright. Alright, y'all. I think we good. Let's see what we got. Oh, it came off. It came off. And it's the old water pump. Right there. Alright. It's the old water pump. That's it. And that right there is where we at with it. This is where we at with it. Well, no issues when we put everything back. So no, no dirt, no grim, no nothing. All right. Now, this right here is the new one. This is the new one. So let's open this puppy up. And this the new one. Y'all seeing it comes with the, the gasket with it. And uh, open this one up here. I'm going to take this back in. Alright, so if we open this up. Oh, yeah. Open this up. You'll be able to see that on a second. It is the actual same as that one. Just newer. So let's put that thing on there. Let's see what's happening. Now, when you put it back and you put the gasket back on, you can see the issue. Issue is you have to make sure all the holes line up. You have to make sure all the holes, everything line up. Just as easy as you can get it. And once everything line up, then you are good to go. Alright everybody. As y'all can see, I got the pump back on. 
I just had to put all the screws back. It was fairly easy. Uh, and the camera stopped, but all the Titan, they all eights and tens. These two, let me show y'all right here. Show y'all right, right here. So one and these two right here, tens. The rest of these, all eights. And just tighten them up the spec and you're good to go. We're gonna put the hoses on and we're gonna put this back on first. And then we're gonna see what's going on. All right, the hoses are back on. Now let's tighten these puppies back up. We definitely got to do that. All right, y'all. All right, y'all. Now we're putting this back on. And you just got to line it up with the holes. And then, you no know, stick them in. One by one. Don't tighten them. Just make sure all of them go in first. One by one. And then you tighten that thing later. But you make sure all of them go in one by one first. Just like that. All of them in. All of them in. Perfect. 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 They all in. Now they can start to get the tightening. There you go. Mm. 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 Make sure all of these are tightened up. All right, y'all, it's about to rain, but I'm putting the serpentine, I'm putting the belt back on. So I'm going to put a picture in, the, in uh, my video to show y'all how to put the belt back on. Because man, oh man, it, it, it'll be something if you don't know how to put the belt back on. But let me tighten everything up and put these tools up because it's about to rain. Y'all hold on for me. All right, y'all. So, all right, y'all. So everything is, uh, what is up with this thing here? All right, y'all, everything is put back. Everything, the belt, and like I said, I'm gonna leave a picture of how you put the belt back at the end of the video to make sure because it's hard to put that belt back if y'all don't know how it goes. So right now, I got the fluid, I got the water. Y'all see, there's nothing in here, nothing in the reservoir. So let's put some water in there. Let's put some fluid in there, and let's see what happens when I crank this baby up. Alright y'all, so I done filled that puppy up. Y'all see the floater? The floater is all the way, the floater is all the way up there. I don't see nothing leaking. That's what you like to see. Nothing leaking. Let's go on to make sure, just to make sure. I don't see nothing leaking. Y'all see anything leaking? I don't see nothing leaking. You're looking good, baby. We, look, we looking good. All right, so that's how you put the water pump on. Y'all make sure y'all do everything right. Ride like a sewing machine. Y'all make sure y'all subscribe. Stay tuned for more. Peace.